Welcome back to Moroni the Village Demon. We left off right before we got to see the end game. I presume it's the end game, but the there's a smell of fire coming from the village. It's probably on fire. Let's do this. I wonder what ending I get, but we'll, we'll see. Suki. Ooh, you can hear the little fire. I can still catch a whiff of the burning smell. The burning smell, it's getting stronger. Hmm. Mom, where did everyone go? Can't go in there. All right, let's go outside. This might be a shorter episode, depending on circumstances. As I'm not sure there's another half hour of this game left. The, the town. Why is everything on fire? This is bad. I have to check on dice game the others. I'm so sorry. Nice. Hey, at least the bridge isn't on fire. Oh, spoke too soon. I feel like this is unavoidable. People are real crispy. Sucks to be them. Daisuke. Behind you. I know, the demon is behind me. The demon, uh... When I woke up, I smelled something burning, so I went to check it out. I went downstairs, and the shadow was standing there, as if anticipating my presence. It told me it'd be arriving soon. Suki, you fell into its trap. No way. Hmm. Maybe this is the bad ending. Suki, can't you see? Is it not obvious? What? I can't move. The shadows paralyzed me. Well, then I'll just come to you and pull you away from the monster. No, don't do that. 
The shadow will kill you if you take another step. What do you suggest I do? Leave. Leave? You expect me to leave? If you don't leave, you're gonna meet the same fate as me. I can't bear to leave you. All the corpses outside. My mom and Hakor are probably gone. I can't lose anyone else. Suki. I really want to be with you. But... I don't think I can. The mark on my hand. Well... It means my fate is sealed. I'm bound to die. Suki, you can't save me. I can't save you? No. You should leave. I can't leave you here to die. Why? Why are you so stubborn? I don't want you to die because of me. Can you listen to my final request? Let me save you one more time. Pretend I'm keeping the demon here and just run away. I want, I want to be more confident. Could you let me do that? Daisuke, are you sure? Positive. Listen, Suki. I like you a lot. And I know you can only think of me as a friend. But even so. I can't bear to live if you passed. Won't you grant my request? Run. Get away from here. I know Tsubaki is in danger. You need to go help her. She's also your friend. Daisuke, what about you? I'll be fine over here. <clears throat> Please don't worry. When you worry, it only makes me worry too. Hmm. Hey Suki, do you remember what you said to me that one day down by the river? You told me no worries, okay? With the happiest smile on your face. Well, Suki? No worries, okay? It's time to return the favor. Suki ran towards Daisuke, and her lips met with his. She gave him a kiss. Daisuke, have this before I go. Suki. I... Thank you. Just then, Suki's left hand began to glow. On it was the same mark as Daisuke's. Suki, watch out. Suki? What the hell did he do to Suki? Bring her back. Oh, that was brutal. Bad end. Love post mortem. Hmm. I'm trying to think back on all of the decisions. Hmm. I wonder which memory five is. 
I don't have any saves for at the back, but let's see what happens if I go back in here after leaving. Because I kind of ran away like a coward. Two main paths in the game, the road of regrets and the road of forgiveness. I won't label each one good or bad simply because in their own way they have something to offer. In other words, some of the stories showcased in the road of regrets would be omitted in the road of forgiveness. If you want a full story, take both paths. And if you're invested enough in the game, I'm sure you go for both paths. Of course, that means mean making saves before important decisions. Now the thing for you to figure out is where these paths diverge. So clearly, I don't even get a good ending. Huh. Let's see where this was. This is before you got the demon book, right? Therefore, this might be before Daisuke had to go look for the kid. If it is, then obviously we can take a different path. Okay. Well, since we're here, uh, yeah, let's let's do that cutscene again and see how that affects the ending. Cause clearly there's slight. I don't know. I don't know what the word would be called. It's definitely a love, like, triangle. Hikaru is, well... Hikaru either likes Daisuke or maybe he's just gay, one of the two. Let's go through this weird cutscene. Let's continue to spend the next few minutes drawing me. Every minute I change my pose. I trip over my own feet. Hickory.
Tsubaki. Hiya. Yeah. So, if my predictions are correct, the depression that Hikaru goes through made the demons stronger. Whenever he was happy, they weren't having near as many issues in the village. So the goal is to keep him happy. Does that mean the others can't be happy? Oh, we're about to find out. Say, I'm kind of hungry. All right, let's stop by the store to get some food. Yeah, I don't think Daisuke's had his hand marked yet. I think I'll visit Daisuke later. Hello, village with people that are still alive. Alright, let's get lunch. You forgot your money, didn't you? Oh no, I forgot my wallet. Whatever shall I do? I know. I'll spend my money on this ridiculously overpriced lunch. So we have mm, different saves. I don't think there's a option in the two. Let's see what's going on. Oh my. That's Gan Hickory. What's going on here? <laughs> Daisuke said he liked me. So I guess he was lying? I'm really confused right now. Well, if they like each other, I can't do anything about that. Now I think about it, these two are pretty cute together. I shouldn't. I shouldn't spy them like this. Just leave the cute boys be. I should probably head back to Sabaki now. You're going to love the food I bought for us. Say, what are you doing beside the door to Daisuke's room? It's nothing. Okay. Hmm. All right, we have five and six. I'm trying to think. So I guess we'll leave five before we make that decision whether to peek or not. I still feel like Path of Regrets involves you just not taking any risks. I don't like that. Leaving already? This was a really bad idea.
considering Suki is the main character. Can we talk about this later? Let me collect all my thoughts. It's fine. I see. Well, let's get going. Our lunch awaits. Mm-hmm. Now, what the hell was that about? Chain of deaths. The man I witnessed dying. I'll get back to you later with my thoughts. Oh. Yeah, I did some posing for Daisuke to practice on. Sounds like it was fun. Oh, and I need to... I need to go soon. I have to catch up on summer homework. Wait, you still haven't started your summer homework? Even more so than me. Dumped it up. Is it any of your business? Well, I mean, I'm just curious. I'm just a little worried, that's all. I don't need you to get along in my face, but I appreciate your concern. If you want, I can help you out with your homework. I'm almost done. I didn't bring it with me, though. You can come over again, and I'll help you out. Why are you being so nice? Well, why not? Well, I've always treated you pretty badly, and I'd inkling you leave me one day. I'm okay with it. That's just who I am. I know you like making snarky remarks. I've grown used to it. Everyone else is, too. Aye. Right. Thanks, you goof. Since you offered, I'll come back again another time for your help. Well, I should probably get going. What was Suki going on about yesterday? Days and days passed by as we enjoyed every moment of our summer. Still, the shadow had not shown itself frequently, resulting in a drop in the death count. And for some reason, the fact worried me. Despite it all, though, I still remained happy and carefree. Because Hikaru was finally happy again. I could only hope that I was worrying over nothing. Though I had a strong feeling that something in the darkness was slowly looming closer to us. We'd have to take action soon or face the consequences. However, a few days later... Alright. This was done before I got dice game marked. I miss the sounds of the river, too. They sound more pleasant than usual. It seems the same to me. Oh, Daisuke, you don't understand. How is the river different today? What a lame misconception. I need to think about this as a... I don't know, normal person. Not my... my weird wavelength. I think they're meant to represent normal people, which means if they are normal, that means those kind of things just kind of happen. And that it doesn't necessarily mean everything, but by not doing those things, they grow distant. I think that's how that's meant to represent. I don't know, that's just how I see it anyway. Looks like I was too stupid to think this over, I'm sorry. Alpha down society to you. It's rare for all four of us to spend together like this. That's alright. Don't beat yourself up. I'm sorry for ruining the fun. Perhaps when things settle down, we can try planning the trip. Yeah, that'd be much better. I'm sure. By saying sorry, you don't go on the trip. Hmm. I wonder what could be up.
Suki, I need your help. Uh, what's the matter? It's my daughter. She went out without me. I don't know what to do. Oh no. This isn't good at all. We have to go find her right away. Don't worry, I'll go get her. I need to tell the others. What's it? I guess we'll let Daisuke do it. I'm sure there's certain options you need to pick and others you don't. No. Huh? Subaki, what are you saying? She's in grave danger in the forest. We can't go into the forest. We'd be putting ourselves in danger too. But she has a point to shadow. I just have a bad feeling. But if we leave her, who knows what will happen? She's going to be in danger if we don't help her. I'm going to go find her. If you're scared of going with me, then just wait for me. I'll be back. Suki, I'll go. What? You stay here with the others, I'll go find her. But why? I can't stand the fact that you're putting yourself in danger. So I'll go. Please? Can't we both go? No. I mean, I got this. I don't need to be in danger. Well? If you insist. I won't lay you down. You better not. Alright, it's time to find the girl. Suki's counting on me. I have to find her quickly. Hello? Anybody in here? No one. I wonder if I'm in the forest the girl went. Maybe I have to prevent Suki from getting marked. The part of the forest that looks completely different than it did a while ago. I saw, I saw a big shadow. It chased me into the forest. A shadow, huh? Please tell me you're alright. Yeah. This isn't good at all. We need to get out of here quickly. Thank you. Let's get going. Let's get through this chase scene. I have an idea. Well, this isn't going to be easy. This is a pretty long path to follow.
But I think I have an idea. If we don't go on that trip, Hickory won't feel depressed. I, th I think that's how that's supposed to work. Okay, from there we need to go up. Okay. And from there we go straight forward. God, I'm bad at this. Then that means the goal is not to let any of them get marked so that at the end they can actually get away. Therefore, rejecting the hide and seek would prevent Subaki from getting the mark. Maybe that's it. We have to run from getting marked. Going on that trip, Sabaki will get marked. Daisuke would have got marked here if he had came second. No, no. He gets marked. I'm trying to think here. Either way, this is before any of them got marked. After minutes of being chased by that shadow, we were finally able to escape the forest arena with Suki and the others. But we managed to save the kid, because she didn't go. Oh, thank heavens you're safe, Fumiko. I'm so sorry for leaving the house. Something chased me outside and into the forest. Please don't worry me like this ever again. Nasuke, thank you so much for finding Fumiko. I'm truly grateful. Glad to help, Hannah. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused you. It's no problem at all. We're just happy that Fumi goes back, and I'm sorry for trying to discourage you two. Suki, Daisuke, I was just being plain selfish. You were right, Tsubaki. Daisuke was in danger going to the forest, so there's no need to feel bad. Hikaru. He was always too nice. We should get going, Fumiko and I. Well, goodbye and thanks again. Let's get going too, shall we? Mm-hmm. It finally happened. The shadow made another appearance, and this time it was set out to get us. Daske specifically. I was sure that it wasn't done there. I had to act fast to protect the people around me and the town's growing happiness. Okay. You became engrossed in reading the book. Daisuke being chased by the shadow. I knew it wasn't gone for good. Still, it was really sweet of Daisuke facing that danger for me. Otherwise, I could have been the one being chased by the shadow. And if it catches you, then what? Never mind that, I have to do research on the shadow. I know it's not going to give up and walk away, so maybe background information would be ideal. Time to read that book. Not going outside right now. Okay, time to get to work. Let's see here. Encyclopedia of Daemons. Here it is. Time to give it a little read. Said to roam royal Japan, the demon sets its sights on little villages. It will murder them all to gain more power. From recent incidents, the village can gain a mark for impaired movement, speech to the state of complete stasis, and the mark's effectives vary. 
At greater strength, the shadow can replicate itself for control subs subsidiaries as it wishes. Unfortunately, due to the lack of cases in recent years, any more information on the demon is scarce. That's all. This is terrible. So I guess the shadow won't stop torment us anytime soon. Now what was this? Hazardous writing. If you want to know more about the shadow, go to the cabin east of town. Know more about the shadow. Hmm. There's nothing else in the book about the shadow, so... One might think of this message screams suspicious. Oh, that's right, I totally forgot. Kazumi invited me over today. I wonder what she has to say. Let's head over. Thanks for inviting me, Kazumi. It took me a while to gather all my thoughts. You were here before. And you were able to escape due to one of your parents or someone having a piece of the demon. I was told Daisy's mother became strict and relentless and Daisy died. This town has been peaceful until recently the shadow returned and there is no concrete solution. Not that we know of. Is it not possible to just leave the town? If the solution was that easy, I would have already left. The shadow would target them back then. This is truly worrying. I'm at a loss on what to do. Have you already taken a look in the library? I have. I found a book detailing the shadow's powers. In most cases, they were wiped out. But it said, in most cases. I understand. I'll be seeing you. Welcome back, Tsubaki. Hiku told me he'd be arriving. He said he'd be helping you with homework. Oh, that boy never ceases to amaze me. Ha, ah, yeah. He's been... He's helping me finish up my summer homework. He's already mastered all the subject matter. Where's he now? He's in the washroom fixing up his hair and trying to look good. Isn't that cute? He's always willing to go the extra mile for you. Well, I don't do much. No, no, don't be so modest. Yeah. I may tease him a lot, but I don't mean any of it. And with that, that's what friends do, isn't it? Now don't let me keep you here. Go upstairs and wait. I guess it wouldn't hurt to look around a bit, too, I guess. Alright, and we'll leave off here. Well, we saw one of the bad endings. Love post-mortem. That must be a path of regret. Maybe. Either way, Suki was not marked yet. And we declined going on that trip to try to prevent Sabaki from getting marked. Daisuke, I don't know how we got marked. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. If you didn't, thanks for watching anyway, and I will see you in the next video. As always, goodbye.